Okay, so I've been a part of Belmont's Office of Leadership Development, aka BOLD, for a very long time. I absolutely love BOLD, and I'm so glad that I get to be a part of that organization, and I'm working towards my co-curricular certificate in leadership development. I'm literally 5% away from earning that, um, which is really only one last thing that I can't do until next year. So, um, not the point. There is this dude who every single time that I go to a bold activity, I see, and you know, he's cute. He's really nice. He's extremely funny. Um, and I remember when I was a freshman, they obviously have like different organizations and things you can be a part of. Um, they have members come out on the stage during your little freshman um, TT period. And I remember this kid, this dude came out on the stage and I was like, oh, this guy's kind of cute. <laughs> like, uh, but he's probably a senior, so there's no chance. And then I saw him at Pulse and I was like, oh my gosh, okay, this dude's cute. He's helping lead a session. Okay, like, um, he gave a tower talk and I was like, okay, this dude's cute. He's nice. Oh, nice back story. Um, then we did bold moves together, found out that he's actually a junior, which means last year he was a sophomore. I was like, oh, okay, this is cool. Saw him again at Pulse, got to know him a little bit better. Um, but that's it, you know, he's just my bold crush. That's all he is. There's nothing that's ever going to come from it. Um, but I can still say he's nice to look at and he's a great guy. And to the person who is my bold crush, thank you for just being you. Honestly, that's the first time I've said that. But thank you for just being you. Because you being you has had an impact on my life and inspired me to become an even better leader. So thank you so much. And I truly wish you the best in life.